Hello and welcome to this new video of the list dedicated to the programming of the Raspberry Pi in an easy way. You will find the, the link of the list in the description. In this video we will see how to control any object connected to the Raspberry Pi using an Android app that we will make with the tool MIT App Inventor. Uh, this will be uh, done by sending HTTP request from uh, the app. This is uh, the final result. First, let's go to the site easycoding.tn and search for any link to EasyPython. I will make a program to set the Raspberry Pi as a server waiting for incoming HTTP request. Put the address of the board. You can see more about the HTTP server in the Python series. Now I will display the incoming HTTP request. Now I will upload my program and execute it. Execute the program with the command python3. Here our server started, so I will send some HTTP request from the browser. As you can see, the board received the request, but it contains some unuseful information. So now I will improve my program by clearing the incoming request and keep only the important message. For that, I have a block. So first, I will put the incoming request into a variable. After that, I will clear it. Now I will make the program to switch on the LED2 when I receive on. If I receive off, I will switch it off.
Here, please uh, change it to low. When I'm testing with the browser, it works. Now I'm ready to make my Android app. So go to the site MIT App Inventor and connect with your Google account. Create a new project. Here I will add two buttons, one for on and one for off. Don't forget to add the hidden component web to send the HTTP request. Now I will program the two buttons to send the HTTP request. And here we are, you can test your app. I hope that you liked the video and see you soon. Bye.